Migration is a fascinating phenomenon observed in various animal species. It involves the regular, seasonal movement of animals from one region to another, often due to changes in weather, food availability, or breeding patterns. Many birds, mammals, fish, and even some insects participate in migration, traveling long distances to find suitable habitats for survival. This behavior helps them avoid harsh conditions and take advantage of favorable environments during different times of the year. The exact reasons and roots of migration can vary widely among species. Humpback whales. Humpback whale migration is another fascinating natural phenomenon. These magnificent marine mammals are known for their extensive annual migrations, covering vast distances between their feeding and breeding grounds. During the feeding season in the summer months, humpback whales travel to colder, nutrient-rich waters near the poles. They primarily feed on krill, small fish, and plankton. These feeding grounds are often found in polar regions like the Arctic and Antarctic. As winter approaches, humpback whales undertake a long journey to their breeding and calving grounds in warmer tropical or subtropical waters. They use these warmer waters as safe havens to give birth and nurse their young calves. Humpback whales are famous for their complex and beautiful songs. Which are believed to play a role in courtship and communication during the breeding season. After calving, the mother humpback whales invest significant effort in nurturing and protecting their calves before beginning the return journey to their feeding grounds. Their migratory routes can cover thousands of miles, and humpback whales display remarkable navigation skills during these journeys. The exact routes and timing of their migrations can vary depending on the population and geographic location. Humpback whale migration is a magnificent sight to behold, and witnessing these gentle giants in their natural habitat is a truly awe-inspiring experience. It also serves as a critical ecological process. As humpback whales contribute to the marine ecosystem's health through their feeding and transport of nutrients across vast ocean expanses. Flamingos. Flamingo migration is a captivating spectacle seen in some flamingo species, particularly the greater flamingo and the lesser flamingo. While not all flamingo populations undertake long-distance migrations, those that do exhibit fascinating seasonal movements. Flamingos are water birds known for their vibrant pink plumage and unique feeding behavior. They inhabit a variety of wetland habitats, such as salt pans, lagoons, and shallow coastal areas. In search of suitable breeding and feeding grounds, flamingos often migrate between different locations. The migration patterns can vary depending on factors like food availability, water levels, and weather conditions. One well-known example of flamingo migration is the movement of greater flamingos in Africa. They may travel considerable distances between breeding colonies and feeding areas in response to changing environmental conditions. During their migratory journeys, flamingos use their powerful wings to fly long distances. In some cases, they may form large flocks, creating a mesmerizing sight as they fly together in graceful formations. The timing and roots of flamingo migrations can be influenced by a combination of instinctual factors and responses to environmental cues. For example, they may follow the availability of food resources or water sources. Observing flamingo migration can be a truly enchanting experience, and it highlights the remarkable adaptability of these elegant birds to different habitats and environmental conditions. Zebra. Zebra migration is a fascinating natural phenomenon where zebras travel in large groups between different regions in search of food and water. These migratory movements are often driven by seasonal changes and are essential for the survival of these animals. During migration, zebras undertake long and arduous journeys, forming impressive herds that can number in the thousands. This behavior helps them avoid predators and find more favorable grazing areas. The most famous zebra migration occurs in the Serengeti ecosystem, where millions of wildebeest and other animals also participate in the Great Migration. Arctic Tern 
The Arctic tern holds the title for the longest annual migration of any known animal. These remarkable birds breed in the Arctic regions during the summer and undertake an extraordinary journey between their breeding grounds and their wintering grounds in the Antarctic region. This migration allows them to follow the endless summer sunlight and access rich feeding grounds in both polar regions. Here's an overview of the Arctic tern migration. Breeding season, during the Arctic summer, typically from May to August. Arctic terns breed in the coastal areas and islands of the Arctic regions, including northern North America, Europe, and Asia. Post-breeding migration, as the summer comes to an end, usually in September, the Arctic terns begin their long journey southward. They start their migration from the Arctic and gradually make their way to the Antarctic. Southward journey, the Arctic terns travel over vast distances making stops along the way to rest and feed. They follow a zigzagging route, avoiding the harshest weather conditions and maximizing access to food sources, such as fish, krill, and other small marine organisms. Wintering in the Antarctic, by December, the Arctic terns reach the Antarctic region, where they spend the austral summer, the southern hemisphere's summer, feeding and preparing for the return journey. Northward migration, as the Antarctic summer ends in March, the Arctic terns begin their northward journey back to their breeding grounds in the Arctic. Return to breeding grounds, by May, the Arctic terns arrive at their breeding grounds in the Arctic, ready to start the cycle again. This remarkable round-trip migration can cover a distance of around 70,800 kilometers or even more, as some individuals may take longer detours. The Arctic Tern's ability to navigate such vast distances across different hemispheres is a testament to their remarkable instincts and adaptability, making them one of the most incredible migratory birds in the world. Butterflies The butterfly migration refers to the phenomenon where large numbers of butterflies travel long distances during their life cycle. One of the most famous examples of butterfly migration is the migration of the monarch butterfly. The monarch butterfly is known for its remarkable long-distance migration in North America. Each year, millions of monarch butterflies undertake a journey that spans thousands of miles between Canada, the United States, and Mexico. The migration of monarch butterflies is a multi-generational process, as different generations take part in different stages of the journey. Here's an overview of the migration. Summer generations, during the warmer months, the monarchs breed and lay eggs in the northern parts of the United States and Canada. These butterflies complete their life cycle relatively quickly, living for only a few weeks. Fall migration, as summer comes to an end and the temperatures drop, a special generation of monarchs, known as the Methuselah generation, emerges. Unlike the summer generations, these butterflies have a much longer lifespan, up to eight or nine months. They are the ones that undertake the southward migration. Journey to Mexico, the Methuselah generation of monarchs embark on an incredible journey. Flying thousands of miles from the northern regions of the United States and Canada to specific wintering sites in the Oyamal fir forests of central Mexico. Wintering in Mexico, once in Mexico, the monarchs gather in vast clusters, covering the trees in the high-altitude forests. They remain in the wintering sites from late fall to early spring, surviving the winter months in a state of dormancy. Spring journey north, as spring arrives, the monarchs begin their northward migration. Heading back to the southern United States and Mexico to lay their eggs and continue the cycle. The monarch butterfly migration is considered a spectacular natural event and a remarkable feat of endurance and navigation for such delicate creatures. Conservation efforts are in place to protect their habitats and ensure the preservation of this incredible migration phenomenon. Salmon Salmon migration is a remarkable natural phenomenon observed in several salmon species, such as the Atlantic salmon and Pacific salmon, which include species like Chinook, Coho, Sockeye, etc. These fish undertake extraordinary journeys to complete their life cycle. Salmon are born in freshwater rivers and streams, where they hatch from eggs laid by adult salmon. They spend their initial months or years in these freshwater habitats, growing and developing into smolts. 
when the time is right. The adult salmon begin their migration from the freshwater to the ocean. They undergo physical changes to adapt to the saltwater environment during this transition. Once in the ocean, they spend several months to a few years at sea, feeding and growing in the rich marine waters. When the time comes for them to spawn and reproduce, they instinctively return to the exact same freshwater streams where they were born. This return journey can be hundreds or even thousands of miles long. They navigate using their keen sense of smell and the Earth's magnetic field to find their way back to their natal spawning grounds. Upon reaching their destination, the salmon face many obstacles, including strong currents and predators, as they swim upstream. They eventually reach their spawning grounds, where females lay eggs, and males fertilize them. Sadly, after spawning, the adult salmon often die, and the cycle begins anew as the next generation hatches and the life cycle repeats. Salmon migration is essential for maintaining the balance of ecosystems and providing vital nutrients to the surrounding environment. It is also an essential aspect of cultural and economic significance for many communities that rely on salmon for sustenance and traditions. Bat Bat migration is a fascinating phenomenon where bats travel long distances to seek better resources or escape harsh weather conditions. Different bat species exhibit migratory behavior, and they often move in large groups, called colonies. Their migration patterns can be influenced by factors like food availability, temperature changes, and breeding cycles. Bats use echolocation to navigate during their journeys, making them skilled travelers, despite the darkness of night. Gray Whale Gray whale migration is an incredible annual journey undertaken by these majestic marine mammals. They are known for one of the longest migrations among mammals. Each year, gray whales travel thousands of miles between their feeding grounds in the Arctic and their breeding grounds in the warmer waters off the coasts of Mexico and California. During the northward migration, which occurs in spring, the gray whales and their calves swim northward along the Pacific coast of North America. They use the rich feeding grounds in the Arctic to fatten up before the return journey south. In the fall, during the southward migration, they swim back to their breeding grounds in the warm waters, where the pregnant females give birth and nurse their young. After the calves are born and strong enough, they join the journey back north with their mothers. Gray whales' migration is an impressive natural spectacle, drawing the attention of people around the world who gather to witness and appreciate the beauty of these amazing creatures. Wildebeest the wildebeest migration is one of the most impressive and well-known natural events in the world. It takes place annually in East Africa, primarily between the Serengeti National Park in Tanzania and the Maasai Mara National Reserve in Kenya. The migration is a continuous cycle that follows the availability of food and water. Around 1.5 million wildebeest, along with hundreds of thousands of zebras and gazelles, take part in this extraordinary journey. The main phases of the migration are as follows. Calving season, the wildebeest give birth to their young in the southern Serengeti, which provides rich grazing for the new arrivals. Rutting season, this is the mating season for the wildebeest, and it occurs during the transition period before the main migration. Long rainy season, as the dry season ends and the rains begin, the herds start moving northward towards the Maasai Mara in search of greener pastures. River crossings One of the most iconic moments of the migration is the dramatic river crossings, where the wildebeest brave crocodile-infested waters, typically in the Mara River, to reach the Maasai Mara in Kenya. Short rainy season, the herds start moving southwards again as the short rains provide water and fresh vegetation in the southern Serengeti. The wildebeest migration is a remarkable display of nature's rhythm and a crucial event for the survival of these animals, as it ensures access to food and water throughout the year. It is also a popular attraction for wildlife enthusiasts and tourists from around the world who come to witness this awe-inspiring spectacle.